Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Tech of Tomorrow. I'm Elric Ferris. We have a very, very special guest here today. We have JJ from ASUS, and we're going to feature one of their latest monitors. That's right. This is their 144 hertz, 27-inch monitor, and I know that it's very, very hard to actually show you guys a lot of stuff through a YouTube video, but we're going to probably show you some features that you didn't know that you could take advantage of with having those great refresh rates. So I'm going to hand the floor to JJ, and he's going to show you this great new monitor. Okay guys, like Doc was talking about, here we've got our brand new VG278 monitor. And one of the biggest things we've actually found out with our previous generation 3D Vision monitors is that some users aren't actually enabling the higher refresh rate uh, because it's not automatically enabled. So two things right before we actually show you how to do this on the desktop is one, you wanna make sure that of course you have a graphics card that supports this. Uh, so that's gonna be GTX 460 and above and make sure you get the latest version of the GeForce driver. Uh, from there, we're just gonna go ahead and right click on the desktop and you have two options, either screen resolution or NVIDIA control panel. We're going to go through screen resolution. Uh, once you're there, you just need to go ahead and click on the advanced settings tab. And from there, head over to the monitor tab. Once you go over to the monitor tab, you're going to see that you have an option that says screen refresh rate. Okay. And right now we're at 60 Hertz. And so all we need to do is go ahead and select 120 Hertz. If maybe you're using uh, one of our first or second generation 3D vision panels, if you have this one, actually the VG278, then you can go ahead and select the 140, 40 Hertz. It'll take a moment to go ahead and send over that information. And from there, now we're set it, we've set it to 144 hertz. And at that point, now we're going ahead and taking advantage of the actual faster refresh rate. So that allows us to have a more uh, fast and responsive and fluid 2D desktop, as well, of course, as a more fluid and responsive 3D desktop in-game. And with that, guys, if you want to check out more information regarding the specifications and the features of this monitor, make sure and click here.